What's up guys, I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media back with another global three year video today. So far we've talked about Dragon Zones, Potential Orbs, and Perunga Wishes. If you guys haven't watched those videos yet, then make sure to check them out after you finish watching this one. By the way, we've had a lot of newcomers to the Tiger Squad recently, so before I get a bunch of comments, I just want to say yes, your boy is all tatted up, and one of these days I might make a video talking about my ink, but today? is not that day. Now, I think it's time to address the elephant in the room, Dragonstones. I know some of you are like, you just said you already talked about Dragonstones. Actually, I'm not referring to the ones that you drop into banners to pull our nails. <laughs> nah, I'm talking about special Dragonstones today, specifically the red Dragonstone and the purple Dragonstone. I'm sure at this point that a lot of you already know what they are, but keep in mind, that we have a ton of new players joining every single day, especially around big celebrations like this. So, what I'm gonna do before I make my recommendations for the best picks, is go over what they are and how you can get them. Let's start with the Red Dragon Stone. So this stone has been given out a couple times over the course of the game's life, and it allows you to pick from one of the old, old type leads like AGL, SSJ3 Goku, and a few others. Now the process to acquire the stone can get pretty complex, so make sure you pay real close attention. You just log in. <laughs> that's right, that's all there is to it. So just log in during the event period and you'll find it in your gift box. Collect that bad boy, head over to the Baba Shop and exchange it for one of these units. AGL Super Saiyan 3 Goku, Tech Perfect Cell, Int Ultimate Gohan, Strength Broly, not the one that goes LR, Physical Full Power Frieza, Strength, Super Saiyan 3, Vegeta, Physical Kid, Boo, Tech, Beerus, and possibly the Family Kamehameha Trio. As far as the Purple Dragonstone goes, it's also a fairly simple process. The units you get are a little bit more exciting than the Red Stones, but it's gonna cost you some cash. Yeah, so this one isn't free. It comes bundled with the biggest stone pack during the 3 year anniversary celebration. They bumped it up to 100 stones and it's gonna cost you a cool 45 US dollars. I'm not going to get into how reasonable that price is in this video, but you can feel free to leave your opinions in the comments. If you decide to pick up the purple dragonstone, you can exchange it for one of the 120% or Neo God type leads. If you need a refresher, they are Strength Super Saiyan 4 Goku or Strength Janemba, AGL Super Saiyan 4 Vegeta or AGL Super 17, Tech Super Saiyan 3 Goku or Tech Super Saiyan 3 Broly, Physical Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks or Physical Cooler, and Int Gogeta or Int Kid Buu. So now that you know what these stones are and how to get them, let's get into my recommendations for the best units to pick. Starting with the Red Dragon Stone, I gotta go with my boy Super Saiyan 3 Goku. He was the first unit to get an Extreme Z Awakening, and in my opinion, still the best one we've seen so far. When fully awakened, this guy hits like an absolute freight train. He also does some solid tanking and is optimal on 3 different units plus Super AGL. Mind you, Broly, Frieza, and Cell all have their Extreme Z Awakenings as well and are perfectly fine choices. I also have no doubt that every other unit on this list will eventually get an Extreme Z Awakening too. Nonetheless, I think Super Saiyan 3 Goku is the way to go for now. And in fact, I will be picking up my last clip of him with my own Red Dragon Stone so you can finally taste the rainbow. This video is not sponsored by Skittles. Let's talk about the Purple Dragon Stone. I want to start off by saying that all the 120 leads are good in their own way, but some are definitely better than others. If you're a newer player, you should make your pick based on which one you can build the best team around or which one you're missing. In general, the super leads are considered to be better than the extreme leads, with the exception of Physical Cooler, who's freaking awesome. If I were to narrow it down to only two units, I'd have to go with Int Gogeta and Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks at the top. You can't really go wrong with either of these guys, they're both extremely hard hitters with really solid teams. However, Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks edges out Int Gogeta in the categories department, fitting perfectly on four different categories versus just one for Gogeta. So if I had to pick just one, then physical Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks would undoubtedly be my choice. I'll also keep in mind that Ink Gogeta will be featured on the LR Gogeta banner, so wait to see if you can pull him from there before making your pick. That'll do it for today's video. I recommend going for Super Saiyan 3 Goku with the Red Dragonstone and Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks with the Purple Dragonstone, but I would love to hear your opinions as well. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys plan to pick. That's all from me. Hope you guys found the video useful. If you liked the video, 
make sure to like the damn video and if you are new to the channel and your first time watching me and you like what you see then maybe hit that big red subscribe button join the tiger squad now but it's up to you anyways hope you guys have a fantastic day i'm tiger with tiger uppercut media signing out